so it's Friday 3rd of July and today's our very last maths lesson on money. So we're going to be comparing amounts of money. Now you might recognise our greater, less than and equal to signs. And we have to pretend that these signs are crocodiles. So we know that crocodiles can be very greedy, which means that they always eat the larger amount or the bigger number. Okay? So let's take a little look at our first questions then. So we've got to use the signs in each of the boxes to compare the amounts on either side. Okay, so we've got 55 pence or one pound and 45 pence. Well, I know that one pound and 45 pence is greater than 55 pence. Okay, so I'm going to be drawing my crocodile's mouth, my greater than sign, to face this amount here. Okay, let's take a little look at the next one then. So we've got seven pounds and 55 pence, or five pounds and 33 pence. So in order to work this out, I will look at your pounds amount first and decide which one's bigger and I'd like you to point to face your hands to show which amount your crocodile is going to eat. Okay, so hopefully your hands, your crocodile's mouth is facing this way because we know that seven pounds and fifty-five pence is greater than five pounds and thirty-three pence. Okay? So let's take a look at one more. So we've got twenty pounds or twenty-two pounds and twenty pence. So again, show me your greater than sign, which way it's going to be facing. Fantastic, well done. So we know that twenty-two pounds is greater than twenty pounds. So our greater than sign is going to be eating the larger amount, okay? And then you might see on your sheet today some pictures of notes and coins, so we've got to add them up to decide which one is greater. So over here, we've got a five pound note, or we have got some pound coins, so we can count them up and write the amount above so that we, we remember. So we've got one pound, two pound, three pound. Okay, so we've got to think which one is bigger? Is it five pound or three pound? Well done, so we know five pound is greater than three pound. Okay, and let's take a look at one more. So we've got one pound and 50 pence. So I'm just going to write that below to help me. So one pound and 50 pence. Okay. Or on this side, we have a 10 pound note. So I know that 10 pound is much larger than one pound 50. So my greater than sign is going to be facing this way. Okay, so good luck with your challenges today. And I just wanted to say a very big well done for all your hard work this week. I hope you have a lovely weekend and I will see you very soon.